Now we are at the FENCE Executive Committee, so uh, we are working on the organization of FENCE, including the preparation of the Glasgow meeting. So it's a, a lot of work in advance to make it as good as possible. The meeting in Glasgow, it's uh, something that allows us to uh, experiment with new activities. We're hoping to build on the introductory courses, which will be a set of introductory courses looking at uh, specific areas that people may not work in but are interested in doing. On Saturday morning, we are inviting several uh, societies, neurocomputation, neuroeconomics, to put together programs, and that's something that never we never had in the past. We're actually now planning to have, at the beginning of the meeting, something a little bit more societally engaging. It's a neuro debate. We hope to attract people that normally wouldn't come to the forum. The actual themes are changing slightly this year. It's important to have sort of uh, topics represented that are forward-looking, not only looking at the history of neuroscience. I think we have a very diverse set of speakers in terms of gender, but also in terms of nationalities, uh, where they come from, what they work on in terms of topics, in terms of um, age, uh, career age. It's going to be a great program. It's going to be all of European neuroscience, but it's also going to be uh, people from the US, people from Japan. In science, we are a global community. And that's what I think slowly the forum is integrating more and more.